Another opportunity. Talking right now with the uh, Carroll Boys track team here today after the, the uh, shuttle hurdle in class of 3A. We're going to talk uh, first of all with uh, Colton Thompson here. Colton, you led things off today. How'd you feel? Um, I felt a lot better than yesterday, that's for sure. Uh, I thought I did a pretty good, you know, pretty good run. I didn't, I didn't hit any hurdles. I might have, might have been a little slow right out of the blocks. Um, that's kind of been a problem for me. But I think, I think overall, I had a pretty decent, uh, pretty decent start. Did you feel any pressure on yourself being a senior down here in your last race? Yeah, definitely. There's, you know, it's the last race. Don't want to screw anything up or try to, you know, uh, you want to make the best of it, you know. And uh, I think that might almost, uh, almost hurt me a little bit, you know, trying not to totally go for it, try to be a little safe or something, you know. I don't know. But, uh, but yeah, there's definitely a lot of pressure. I mean. There's a lot more relaxing yesterday, just because we're in the finals, you know, and that's you know now it's nothing to lose, but but still a lot of a lot of pressure, a lot of uh, adrenaline going. Fifty nine twenty, I understand. Second best time of the year, right? Mm -hmm. You guys pretty pleased with that, I imagine. Yeah, you know, I mean, we're we're happy, I guess. But, I mean, we, we obviously wanted to do better, and we thought we could improve on our, our other our time that we got at Drake, uh, you know. But I mean, you know, it's still it's still a pretty good run for us, and uh, I guess you know we got to be happy with that. But a little part of me is still really kind of disappointing. Uh, Colton, I know we were kind of talking before we started the interview for you three seniors. You guys maybe have run more events here than you have even on your home track. Talk about that and talk about kind of how this place has maybe come, become a kind of feel like home for you. Yeah, you know, I mean, we, you know, obviously, you know, our shuttle team's been down here almost every year and, and uh, and, you know, there's other events and we're at Drake this year, you know, so we got a lot of experience here and it's, you know, it's kind of just like an old routine, but now, you know, it's, it's a lot of fun, you know, we love coming here, it's, it's great and, uh, it just it definitely you know helps with no, not a whole lot of pressure and it's just a lot, a lot more relaxed atmosphere and it's it's really cool. What's what's it mean for you to be here as a senior? I mean it's it's great. It's the perfect way to end your career. You know that nothing's better than, than this track meet here at Drake. You know and and uh, just just a lot of fun regardless of how you finish or how you place. You know just to be a part of it, it's just just awesome. Well, Colton, I appreciate you joining us. It's been a lot of fun down here with you over the years and. Best of luck coming up in the future. Thanks a lot, Jeff. Colton Thompson again. Let's move over to the only senior not in this group in Peyton Renning. And Peyton, uh, how did you feel like you ran here today? I felt like I had a pretty good leg. I don't know if it was as good as yesterday because I clipped one hurdle towards the third to last hurdle, I think it was. Got it pretty hard. Got me off balance a little bit. Just try to have a keep on going. Are you... Talk about this group of guys here as it's getting kind of loud here right now. you got three seniors with you. Yep. Talk about this group. What's it been like running with these guys? It's been a blast running with these seniors for the past three years, three years of my Noah career. Thomas I know that we just had so much fun bonding great, together as a team. And just, I know, just a great season, great year, three years with them. Any stories you can tell us about these guys? I know that Drake, no, no, no. <laughs> Drake, we know we had, oh yeah, all, me and Hope and Nate had to sleep in the same bed at Drake because we only had one bed and then a pull-out bed, so we all had to stay in the same bed. bed. <laughs> yeah, we got, we got to know each other. <laughs> had to be fun, though. I, yeah. I mean, you guys look like you guys really get along, and it's a pretty good group. Yeah, it's a great group to run with, I know, and couldn't ask for a better team. What's it been like for you this year, knowing that this is your last year with these guys? Just try to run as fast as I can for them. Just try, try and get them into, into state, help them with the uh, finals as as we can. How will you take on the leadership role now next year and bring along some of the younger guys? I know we have, we're going to have to put it together a whole, pretty much a whole new team for next year. I'll just have to push the other guys, the younger guys, to try and get us back here for a fourth year for me and then first year for most of the other guys, too. So. Well, Peyton, I tell you what, it's been a lot of fun. We hope to see you again down here next year. Best of luck. Thanks very much for everything. Thank you. Peyton Renning again. Let's move over to Nate O'Brien, one of those seniors. And Nate, uh, interesting story. I talked to Colton about it already, but what's your feelings? You've, you've run more meets here. You kind of brought that up. You've run more meets here than you have on your home track over your career. What, what's that like? It's it's a little, it's a little crazy to think about because this is supposed to this is you know the hardest meet to get to or uh, even Drake it's the hardest meet to get to so uh, it's it's a little unreal to think that you know you've been down here you're you're comfortable enough that you're you know I'd rather run here any day than at Carroll but I mean that's how it works out and it's awesome. Had you thought about that before you were sitting down over here after the race? No, I no I haven't thought about that. I've I, you know it's just. I, I realize that I've been here all you know every year, but uh, you know I, I've never clicked that I've ran here more than half of the other places. You know whether it be Storm Lake Carroll, yeah, it's just uh, it's it's and next up, funny we'll how I just you know, you think about those things, especially when it's over. Talk about the race today. Uh, seventh place overall, third in your heat, 59-20, best, the second best time of the year. Uh, what did it mean to be able to do that down here? It was good. Uh, we we know we know that. We could, we still had enough in it. We could have went for a 58, you know, um, but we did better than our prelims. 
you can't ask for much more than that. You know, we we knew coming in, we barely made it in eighth spot, so let's uh, at least move up a couple spots. We moved up one, so you know we're pleased. We got a medal. What are the memories you're going to take away out of all the four years you've come down? Which which is the one you're going to remember the most? Uh, probably just the Drake experience. You know, state you come down here, you're practicing on the you know on the field, and you see all these athletes. But Drake, you know, you're over in the parking lot working on your hurdle work. And you know you're organized all the way down to here, and then you're split up. It's you know it's a lot more organized. You get to see a, a lot better athletes with the college and professional. It's I'd say just the whole experience of Drake was probably the most uh, memorable. Well, Nate, appreciate you joining us. Great job. It's been a lot of fun. Thank you. Let's move over now to Isaac Roselman, who has uh, run the anchor leg here again today. Isaac, uh, let's start off with the race. Uh, how did you feel here today? Any pressure coming into it being your last race in high school? Uh, not really. I mean, like Nate said, we're just comfortable down here. We've ran here more than we ran at home, so this is pretty much our second home. So, I'm me personally, I'm comfortable running down here. I love this track. It's a fast track, and it's just a great place to run. You made two comments before we started talking that kind of really hung with me. One, you're going to miss this place. Oh, yeah. I'm going to miss it here. I'm going to miss our team. I mean, it's just the experience of coming here every year you've been in high school and just running. It's just what it's all about is coming here, making it to state. And I'm just, just going to miss that. High school track is probably the best sport out there for me personally. And as I say, you said that as well. You're going to go on and do it in college. But you said you're really going to miss high school track. I am. There's, there's nothing like it. I mean, it's a huge bonding time for just the team like we come here as a team not individuals and I mean we all support each other no matter what happens it's just like we're a giant family talk about the race real quick happy with it today how'd you feel I'm happy with it I mean yeah we didn't we came down at state third we get we barely made it to finals in eighth but we moved up to seventh and we ran our second best time of the year so you got to be happy with that I mean yeah, we probably could have done better, but we got to take what we got and go with it. Well, Isaac, I tell you what, it's been a lot of fun talking to you down here all of the all years. We wish you the best luck coming up at Iowa Western. And thanks very much for all your time. Thank you.